Get ready to get sentimental about junk food. Welcome to Watch Mojo, and today we're counting down our picks for the top 10 candies that will make you nostalgic. For this list, we're looking at our favorite candies that we ate as kids, and we're excluding chocolatey good things because those are worthy of a list for another day. Number 10. Fun Dip Some of the products we're going to talk about today have been discontinued, but this is one candy you can still buy if you want a hit of nostalgia. In fact, Fun Dip has far more nostalgia factor than you may know, being on the market in some way, shape, or form since the 1940s. It's a little wet, and now it's got the dip on it. Let's have a taste of this. Mmm, doesn't that look good like sugar crystals? The powdered confection that makes up Fun Dip isn't anything special on its own. It's actually quite similar to what you'd find in Pixie Sticks. But the novel thing about it is, of course, the dipping part. Each pack comes with a candy stick that you can use as a utensil and then eat afterwards. And what's more fun than that? Edible sporks? Maybe, if they exist. Number 9. Scooby-Doo Fruit-Flavored Snacks Now you can get all of Scooby-Doo's friends in your box of Scooby-Doo Fruit Snacks. Another product you can totally still get your hands on are the Scooby-Doo Fruit Snacks. Although, you might be a bit disappointed by the changes that have been made to the flavor selection. We can all agree that the blue Scooby Snack was the best Scooby Snack. But at some point, the makers of these tasty treats decided to change the flavor of the blue gummy. Why? Who even does that? Luckily, we are not alone in our outrage, because a now-closed Change.org petition managed to find over 3,600 people willing to demand Betty Crocker change it back. Number 8. Runts Don't be afraid. There are little surprises everywhere, but nothing too dangerous. Sometimes it's the simplest candies that bring back the most memories. Runts are an OG classic. Around since the 80s and seemingly available in every candy vending machine in every grocery store across America and beyond. Shaped like hard, tiny versions of your favorite fruits, runts are still available, but the flavors have changed over the years. In 2007, they tried to give the flavors a more tropical twist by adding mango and pineapple, but they were clearly not well received because just two years later, they were removed from the lineup. Number 7. Warheads That's an extreme sour. No! You okay, bro? Let's do that again. <laughs> there's sour candy and then there's warheads. These things were like a challenge on the playground, with the boldest kids showing off how many they could handle shoving in their mouths at a time. Warheads are almost uncomfortably sour because of the use of malic acid, which is what gives them their distinctive flavor. Warheads have been around in the States since the early 90s, although it is possible to imagine the novelty must have worn off a bit after all these years. Even today, the classic flavors are still intact. Blue raspberry, lemon, green apple, black cherry, and watermelon. Number 6. Hubba Bubba Bubble Jug Sometimes a junk food product gains popularity because of outstanding flavor. Sometimes it's based on good marketing, and sometimes it's just the straight-up novelty factor. Bubblegum was old news by the time Hubba Bubba released their bubble jugs, so they decided to give it to us in a format that was unlike anything we had seen before. This powdered candy came in a tiny jug and turned into gum in your mouth, seemingly like magic. There was an extra special pleasure in being able to chug the powder straight from the jug, or to make your own gum, in your very own mouth. Number 5. Push Pop Push Pop I wish you'd come to the game, Dad, and give me a push. A Push Pop Another tried-and-true candy that had been around for ages was the lollipop. But the Topps company brought the concept into the modern world when they introduced Push Pops in 1986. Unlike a regular lollipop, Push Pops came in their own little canister which you could push up to eat or push down to save for later. As if anyone was doing that. Over the years, they released spin-off products like Triple Power Push Pops, which had three flavors, and spring-loaded Jumbo Push Pops when you wanted a slightly larger serving size. Number 4. Bubble tape. It's six feet of bubble gum for you, not them. Hubba Bubba not only came up with the ingenious bubble jug, they are also the creators of bubble tape, which had a similar novelty factor. Packaged like a roll of scotch tape, this extra long roll of bubble gum was as fun to eat as it was tasty. Did you know that each container held six feet of gum? Well, it did. Two meters of chew, bucko. Now we feel kind of guilty about all the times we ate an entire roll in one sitting. Bubble tape is still around today, though it peaked in popularity back in the 90s when they were manufacturing a million containers per week. Number 3. Pop Rocks Hey, what's happening? The Cracklins, what's happening? Pop Rocks says bang to the pipe! Pop 
We're starting to sense a trend with all these treats. The more unique the concept, the more memorable the snack. Pop Rocks are iconic, and for good reason. They're not just a candy, they're an experience. The popping sensation you experience when you eat them is due to pressurized carbon dioxide. But for kids, it's just plain fun. Now, we've all heard the urban legend about what could happen if you mix Pop Rocks with soda, but after many years of testing, we can confirm it is patently false. So enjoy the combo to your heart's content. Number two, Fruit Gushers. Introducing new Fruitomic Punch Gushers with a taste that's gonna drive you fruity. Another candy that put an emphasis on experience was Fruit Gushers, produced by Betty Crocker starting in 1991. While they may have the exterior appearance of a standard gummy candy in the shape of a gem, once you bit into it, there would be a flavor explosion as the juicy inside was revealed. The two classic flavors were Gush and Grape and Strawberry Splash, but as of 2017, Grape is no longer available. But a host of new flavors have been introduced to make up for its absence. And let's be honest, no one really liked the Grape anyway. I should have gotten some Pop Rocks and done like an ASMR thing into the mic for this. But legitimately, if I were gonna get any of the candies on this list today, it would be our number one. It's the only one I've eaten within the last five years. So let's munch our way through some honorable mentions and then we'll dig into the candy that makes us the most nostalgic. Ouch, painfully delicious. Ouch gum by the 1990s was a gum available in the flavors of grape, watermelon, and strawberry. Each stick of gum was wrapped with a paper and made it look like a bandage and was packaged in a metallic container similar to that of a bandage box. String things. Because why eat things that aren't strings? What's that new shape thing? It's fruit string thing. The fruity snack thing that lets you do amazing things. Shark bites. Bite them before they bite you. Crush dismissed. Shark bites fruit snacks. You've got to eat them before they eat you. Astro pops. Don't choke on the tip and don't chew the wax. And this one here, it's a three flavor lollipop with pineapple, passion fruit, and cherry. Now the packaging says, let's see, specialty candy store edition, 50% larger, Astro Pop original. Dweebs, when you're bigger than a nerd, but soft and chewy. Before we continue, be sure to subscribe to our channel and ring the bell to get notified about our latest videos. You have the option to be notified for occasional videos or all of them. If you're on your phone, make sure you go into your settings and switch on notifications. Number one, Ring Pop. Slip on some Ring Pop star power. What other candy could you possibly use to propose to your primary school crush? Doubling as a fashion accessory and a delicious treat, Ring Pops were the ultimate playground currency. It was pretty great to be able to go about your business with a ring pop on your finger, taking a casual lick every now and then rather than having to hold a stick like the children of yore. Ring pops felt like the future. And did you know that the creator actually invented the candy to stop his daughter from sucking her thumb? You do now, Candy Punk. Do you agree with our picks? Check out this other recent clip from WatchMojo. And be sure to subscribe and ring the bell to be notified about our latest videos.